There have been five fatalities at Station Beach since 2008. Something has to change. The fatalities have all occurred in this area, designated as no swimming. There are heavy rip currents that naturally form along the pier. So what do we want to change? We want to change the narrative around Kincardine's Beach and make Kincardine a leader in beach safety by implementing the Life Saving Society report from 2015, as well as some additional improvements like a stoplight that is programmed to automatically use weather conditions to advise beachgoers of the level of risk at any moment, using all of the same standards as the internationally used beach flag system. There is no language barrier with a stoplight, so it serves all. Additional items include a custom-designed rescue board, not only as an additional safety measure, but also for a tourism photo op, as well as an additional emergency phone and better signage. There's even a remote-controlled rescue device that can be operated from the safety of shore during rescues, enhancing the reach of a standard inflatable device. With the potential for increased local tourism for those looking for beach alternatives, we can look into the addition of beach patrol during peak periods, as well as installing additional emergency vehicle route signage or barriers to prevent vehicles from blocking out first responders in an emergency. A new information board could contain additional information around rip currents and undertow, swimming and no swimming areas, as well as self-rescue techniques, and QR codes to more safety resources. We would also like to add unique markers along the beach to aid in locating victims in an emergency. The costs outlined are intended as budgetary estimates. Proposed scopes will be managed similar to other community improvement projects, such as the boardwalk and splash pad. 